Hi, warm greetings to everyone. We are from Group 1. I am Chatham Kadek Nadek. Mr. E started his business on 1st July 2018 with furniture RM 8000 and cassette bank RM 42000. During the month of July 2018, the transaction took place as follows. So, based on the question, on opening account, on levy, furniture account 8000, bank account 42000, on credit, capital account 50000. On 1st July, purchase good for equal trading on credit RM 10000. On debit, purchase account 3000. Credit on credit, credit equal trading RM 3000. July, Mr. East paid his personal car insurance by check RMP 800. So on that, drawing account 800 and on credit, bank account 800. On July 13th, Nisha sent check to settle all the debts. On debit, bank account 3325 and debt to Nisha on credit 3325. On 15th July, cash sales RM 1500. On debit, cash account 1500 and on credit, sales account 1500. On 21st July, receipt invoice from F1 Trading for purchase goods are at 2500. But on debit, purchase account 2500. On credit, F1 Trading account 2500. On 25th, received a credit note from F1 Trading are at 200 due to spoil items. On debit, FR trading account RM200 and purchase limited account on credit RM200. Lastly, on 29 July, paid salary by check RM3500. On debit, salary account RM3500 and on credit bank account 3500 Hello sir, my name is Kevin Rao. Hi sir, my name is Kevin Rao. And today I'll be presenting about question number one. I'd like to start off with uh, July 15, which is cash sales are 10,500. Um, so first of all, we have to add in cash. July 15, sales 1,500. Next on, we have to add in July 15, uh, cash 1,500. Uh, next is receipt invoice from FR Trading for purchase good are 2,500. So we have to add in FR Trading July 21. Purchases 2500. Next on, we have to add in uh, under purchase. So July 21, FR trading 2500. Uh, next on, received a credit note from FR trading RM200 due to spoil item. So we have to add in purchase return, which is over here. July 25, FR trading RM200. Next on, we have to add in FR trading. July 25, purchase return RM200. And for the last one, 29 July, paid salary by check 3500. So we have to add in salary, July 29, bank 3500. And next one, we have to add in bank as well, which is over here, July 29, salary 3500. That's all for me, sir. My name is Taranish Priya and I am Chandra Sega. Hi sir, uh, today I will be explaining about ledger for question 1. So the question is Mr. E started his business on 1st July 2018 with furniture 8000 ringgit and cash and bank for 40,000 ringgit. So the first thing that we need to do is on furniture account, we need to add capital account on debit side for 8000. And then for the next thing that we need to do is for bank account, we need to add capital account for 8000 on debit side. And then for capital account, we need to add furniture account and bank account at credit side. So for the first question, uh, purchase goods from Inbound Trading or credit uh, credit 3000. So first we need to add Inbound Trading account on debit side for purchase account. And then the second thing is we need to for in Inbound account, we need to add purchase account on credit side. Okay, for the second question, sold goods to Nisa of credit 3500 and she received trade discount for 5%. So, uh, just because for Mr. Is uh, gave 5% discount for Nisa, so we need to first, we need to minus 5% uh, discount on Nisa's purchase. 
says so uh, for so from 3500 you will change to 3325 so the first thing that we need to do is sales account we need to add a uh, nisa account sales account on credit side for 3325 ringgit and then on nisa account we need to add a uh, sales account on debit side for 3325 ringgit so for the second question which is on july 9 Mr. E paid his personal car insurance by check for eight hundred ringgit. So uh, first, uh, for bank, uh, we, for the first thing that we need to do is on we need to add Jobbix account eight hundred ringgit on bank account for credit side, and then we need to add July nine bank account eight hundred ringgit on Jobbix account for debit side. Okay, the the fourth question for this. Thing is on July 13, Nisa sent check to settle all the debts. So before this, we sold 3,325 ringgit value of goods to Nisa. So for the first thing that we need to do is that for bank account, Nisa, uh, we need to add Nisa account for 3,500 ringgit on bank account on debit side. So the second thing that we need to do is for our for Nisa account, we need to add bank account for 3,325 ringgit on credit side. Thank you. My name is Noaim binti Muhammad Yunus. I'm a for the tire balance, we have salary account and salary on the debit side. Um, furniture account, furniture on the debit side. Bank account, bank on the debit side. Um, capital account, capital on the credit side. Purchase account, purchase on the debit side. Um, sales account, sales on the credit side. Ikba trading account, ikba trading on the uh, credit side. Nisa trade Nisa account Nisa on the credit side drawing account drawing on the debit card cash account cash on the debit card debit side if I trading ah uh, account on the credit side and also the last one is ah uh, purchase return account on the credit side.